Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're playing a new game uh, called Nira. Now, it's been in early access for a little while, but today it came out of early access and there's no more review embargo anymore. So today I'm going to be playing it for the first time. Uh, as far as I know, it's a sort of top-down, pixel, sort of graphic, 8 uh survival game. I'm not sure anything past that, though. Alright, here we are. <laughs> um... <laughs> All right, here we are. I'm going to chop, possibly. I'm chopping. Gee darn tree. It's slowly coming down. Oh, there it goes. Got the tree. So I've got a hammer, an axe, some sticks, a coconut. So uh, level up or quest. How am, I, how am I leveling up? Oh, at the bottom. I've, oh, I see. Okay, I have XP at the bottom, and then I also have a level. It's a cactus over here. Die, cactus. Die. So far, uh, visually breathtaking game. Just stunning. But, uh, where do I go off this island? I can only swim a little bit. Okay, it doesn't look like I have, like, a hunger or anything like that. There's a shark. Oh, he's quick with it. <laughs> What's over here? I think if I cruise this way, I'll be good. Stick. Also, I'm not sure where my health is, but... I made it! I'm loose, baby! Thank Christ. I made it out of that place. Alright. Yeah, you get XP for chopping. That's kind of cool. Can I eat this coconut? Oh, I'm eating. Reminds me of a similar video game. I don't see, like, health or hunger or anything anywhere, though. Oh, I'm getting stone. I'm nuts. Is that iron? Oh, hey! Fuck off. I'm bonking this thing. It is iron. Let's go. Not sure what the very first thing I should be, like, crafting is. I'm gonna need tools soon. But I've got enough to make more, it would seem. Put an axe, stone axe, tools level too low, train skills, oh my goodness. There's, what? There's levels for that too, like, man, like, runescape. I can make, oh god, what do you want? They got guns in this? Oh, okay, SMG, rifle, shotgun, sniper. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> Very strange. Um, structures, wooden wall, dishes, we can probably build that, that boat. Yeah, now I might as, might as well sleeping bag. I'm not allowed to make, like, anything cool, though. I've got my boat. Oh my god, shut up. <laughs> I'm boating! Let's go! That was kind of sick. Oh, there's a treasure chest. A f gun? I can shoot men? Oh, I'm gonna drown. I died. From being in the water for f eight seconds? Pretty useless bow. Unless there's monsters at night or something. Which I wouldn't put it past this game, because it's... Basically, Minecraft for the visually impaired, as I was saying. <laughs> if you hate... Good looking games, this would be Minecraft for you. If you were or blind, maybe. Alright, I finally have enough XP. I still was trying to do the train skills thing, which seems like the whole point of the game and the only way to like progress. And I can't. So unless it's based around this main level and then you level your skills, unless that's how it works, I can't do it. Because it is straight up non functional in this uh, version that I have. I don't know why. It's a bug I would imagine, but we're just not finished. I'm level two. What does that even? What does that even mean? Oh, there's a skeleton over here too. I can't do a large portion of the game. It just doesn't work. Hey, gotcha, dingus. The bow seems pretty good. You get infinite arrows, so you can just pick them back up. Let's let's frag out these skeletons of the night. And then I guess we'll call it a day since I can't do anything. I'm not allowed to level any of my shit. 
Don't ask me why. Like, in here, you know, tools, hold an F. Oh, it's working now. Oh my god. Maybe it was based on my level, level too low. Ah, it was based on my character level. I see, okay, okay. Well, now I can make stone tools. Bang. Hey, holy shit. Hi. Gotcha. Made piggy noise. Get some meat off of him. Alright, alright. Another skeleton wants to get some. Ha! 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 What the fuck? Die! Okay, we got him. I think this is a fully automatic bow. And I can just frag out. Anyone else want some? The deer? Some fur? Skeleton. Skeleton. Bad. Bad skeleton. Well, I've seen this gameplay loop before, that's for fucking sure. It's not exactly bad or anything. Like, it's it's pretty good, actually, as far as, like, game goes. What is that thing? What is this shit on the ground? Whoa! Like, it's pretty cool if you're into pixely games like this. But it's kind of got the same sort of gameplay loop that Minecraft has, I suppose. If you like Mein Kampf, you might like this game. I don't know. But I mean, why wouldn't you just play Minecraft? Ow! Ow! Something different, I guess. It's like Terraria and Minecraft, I guess. More or less similar. Not as similar as this, but... Can you stop blasting me? How long do this enemies come for? How long is the night time? I killed many creatures of the night. What is happening? Is this day or s it's snowing? Why is it snowing? What the hell? Is this snow or ash? Snow, I guess? So I can actually level my skills now. That's pretty cool. Whatever this totem level does. I don't know why it takes such a weird jittery... Materials, weapons, you can learn to make a longbow. So you gotta choose between leveling your skills and leveling your actual self, and if you level your actual self, then you can get more skills. So that's pretty cool, I can learn to make a wooden wall here now. That's pretty interesting, actually, it's got a lot of, like, levels to go through. Make an SMG and 5mm ammo. <laughs> it's so strange. I, uh, I get it. I just don't care too much. I feel like you would just play Minecraft if you wanted this. Like, I know I keep saying Minecraft, 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 but it's like the fucking exact same concepts, gameplay loops, everything here as Minecraft, besides the added leveling and skill leveling, which is cool and seems to work pretty well. I will give them that. But, like, it's like 640 XP now for me to level up one more time, which is fucking absurd. And I don't really care that much. I don't really feel like it. So, uh, probably this will do it for me. Uh, definitely decent. You guys see exactly what it is now. You know exactly what it is. I don't think I need to tell you yes or no or anything if you're interested in getting the game. You've seen the game. There's all kinds of shit in here. But, as for, like, a point, there doesn't really seem to be one. Like, the totem wants me to get him a feather. Just kind of a shit quest to have at the beginning, because I assume I just have to shoot these birds. Alright, let's see what happens when we do the feather thing. Take these. Take the feathers! Good lord. Oh my god, it takes forever. It's just feathers, thank you. Alright, he's eating the feathers, I guess. Now you want nine flowers. Was that it? I just got XP. Alright, well. There you go. You've seen the questing. The leveling. The skilling. The survival. It's not really a survival aspect. You're just eating so that you do. If you get hit by, by damage. Alright, well that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, Nira. And uh, yeah, check it out on Steam. It just came out of early access into full release. There's still like no real point to it. Like it doesn't have a narrative or anything it seems like a sort of mission that you're doing like in minecraft where you're trying to get to the end and fight the dragon and all that it seems like i'm kind of just dicking around on the island which is fine it just came out of early access but uh yeah not bad it's all right it's not the most amazing thing i i don't see why i would play it past 
what I've already done. I mean, it's not it's not intriguing me at all. But that's just my own opinion on Nira, and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I'll see you in the next one with another different game, and that's uh, that's about it. Bye. If you guys enjoyed, let me know. Uh, be sure to leave a like, sub, and all that, and uh, I really appreciate it. See you guys in the next one.